Hi friends, in this video we will install uh, OHS in the collocated mode in which uh, uh, OHS will be running ab uh, above WebLogic. So the first thing which we have to do is we have to install the WebLogic server and then we will be installing OHS server. So let me go to the location where my WebLogic is there and uh, I have my oh, let me check it will be inside SOA so this is my infrastructure software so let me just set my export java export home equal to slash oracle JD, jdk 1.8 so now let me just refer to blue 12.2.1. infrastructure.jar uh, we will first have to install uh, uh, weblogic so this is the weblogic installer and uh, then we will have to install OHS product on this so let it get extracted in the meantime let me create one more folder mkdir OHS C-U-L-L and uh, oh, just one Let me check what is the name we have given uh, yeah. KDIR MKDIR OHS1 underscore CLA so and now this is the weblogic installer and uh, we just have to press uh, next we have seen how to install the logic this is just a plain weblogic installer skip updates now here we have to give the location where we want to install this uh, weblogic software uh, oracle installing oracle which is one so this is the location we'll give and we will press next and fusion middleware infrastructure and ok so it has created a problem ok so uh, I have to cancel this and start the installation again so here I will make use of slash oracle jdk 1.8 java bin java hyphen jar fmw under 2.2.1 infrastructure dot jar so uh, you should not uh, proceed further if you see those types of errors uh, uh, i have exported my java home but still it didn't took so that is why i have to uh, invoke this installer with the uh, 1.8 version of gdk so that is why i, st I stopped the installation there and relaunch my uh, logic installation with uh, uh, 1.8 portion of JDK so it will take uh, some time to come up so yeah this is my logic uh, fusion middleware 12 c infrastructure installer you can press next skip auto updates here you give the location where you want to install uh, your uh, component so I given the component and then again for the middleware infrastructure it will do a check you can see this time there is a green mark for my java uh, version so make sure that you get a green mark every time uh, you, if you want to receive email alerts you can give this uh, for other than you can press next and then you can install this uh, weblogic infrastructure on this location once this weblogic infrastructure is installed we will install OHS component on this so now weblogic has been installed you can press next and uh, click on finish and now the weblogic has been successfully installed on our system now the next thing which we have to do is to install the OHS 
and uh, to install OHS we will again uh, go to the OHS software and this is OHS and uh, let me so let me just uh, do the installation for OHS now for installing OHS dot slash fmw 12 dot uh, dot one dot zero zero it's linux dot bin and uh, it will do extract of the which is uh, installer and this time we'll make use of the same uh, uh, web logic home which we have created just now Oracle HTTP server install installer came up. Uh, here next and uh, skip port updates. Uh, here we have to give to the, the same location where we have installed our uh, web logic. So it's just one dot oracle. You can give here, you can click on view and all the components which we have installed in here will come up. So all these core infrastructure came up. Uh, I will press uh, I will have to press next and you have to select collated uh, HTTP server managed through web logic server and uh, next and it will do a prerequisite check of all the components and you have to press next and click on install so it will install OHS above uh, web logic and then we have to go ahead and create a domain uh, OHS collated domain so now OHS has been installed above our web logic. You need to press uh, next and you need to press finish. So now if we go to the location uh, where our uh, installation has been done, let me just go to go there and we'll see uh, OHS along with web logic has been done. So cd OHS OHS1 and if you go here you will find all the software here so we have web logic installation here and uh, we also have uh, we also have installed OHS above this so in the next video we will see how we can create a domain uh, for our OHS in the collaborative mode thank you